hey everybody, my name is Nightwolf, and welcome to Blameless. So this is a horror... Alright. This is a horror adventure indie puzzle game. Sorry, I had to look it up real quick. Uh, so, for what I've seen by the trailer, or the, the or not the trailer, the little clip on Steam and some of the pictures, is that you're in a house, and the story was something like, uh, it's a mysterious first-person adventure game that with a primary focus on puzzle solving and a short story the player will appear in a role of an architect trying to investigate strange happenings after discovering evidence of an act of violence so from what i understand is that we're going to be going around in a house in and out trying to figure out what's going on so let's jump right in and with the halloween with halloween coming right around the corner or two freelance so i take job offers as they arise so, when this guy called me, I was relieved I could finally get a paying job. He said he needed help with interior design for his house that he was building. I always respected people who could do construction, so I naturally agreed to come and take a look. I already had a couple of ideas. It was already quite late, but he insisted on me coming over the same day. I tried to comply, because I didn't want to lose this offer. I drove there with my car. His house okay. was all the way over in the suburban area, quite remote, but with other houses nearby, quiet place. The man met me at the front gate. It was a temporary fence, and the gate was made of rotting wooden planks. He started showing me around the yard. It seemed weird that there was a large garbage container blocking the way, so we had to go through the garage to get inside the house. He took me through the rooms, so I started looking around. At one point, I saw a stain first glance it seemed like brick dust but then I realized it was blood spilled on the floor I thought that maybe there was another worker who got injured so I turned to tell the man that's when I saw his hand raised to hit me he was holding a metal rod before I could defend myself he hit me in the head I must have passed Damn. out I don't know how long I was out <sighs> okay when I woke up Loading screen. <clears throat> okay, so, uh, just gonna before we hit enter to continue in i'm going to uh finish what i was saying uh with halloween right around the corner or two i thought it would be a good idea to play a little more horror to get into the spirit even though i'm not big on halloween i'm not a big fan i just i don't know it's just not my holiday i don't really have a favorite holiday but uh i just thought i would celebrate with you guys a little bit by playing a few more horror games so let's jump in so when we woke up No text, just the visuals, all right? Uh, my head. <sighs> that hurt. Yep. Damn, this place is not good looking. Okay. This place definitely look. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, so this place does definitely doesn't look like it could use some work. I'm just gonna raise, lower the volume a little bit. The ambience is quite loud in my ears. All right. Let's see. Hammer. Can we use this to defend ourselves? My mouse doesn't want to stay in the window for some reason. smashed. No way it's gonna work anytime soon. It's a Nokia advertisement. Okay. Can I, like, not have this in my hand? 
This blood stain does not look like it's the result of a banal injury. For real. This looks like something was being dragged across the blood stain. Da da da. It seems fresh. The blood hasn't completely dried out yet. I better look some more. Alright. Ambient music can fuck off, that'd be great. Is that casting a shadow? Oh, that's impressive for indie work. I'm impressed. Get on the fucking table. Piece of shit. Get on the table! You bitch, you better stay there. Alright, let's see. Hammer. Damn it. Stay. I fucking said. Stay. Stuff. Fine. Fine. We'll put her. Put you there then. Hmm. Let's see. What about this? Oh. Flashlight would be great. Uh, if this guy is still here, <laughs> I mean, would you not, like, hear me right now, running around and dropping shit and picking shit up? So dark. Well, I mean, it's kind of dark. It's lit over here, but I doubt the door handle is going to be in the bright, like, right in the middle of the light okay so going I actually restarted because I dropped the one item we dropped I dropped this so I might be able to get further through the attic all right so I have a little I have a video out in case we get stuck again it's slipping. I can't turn it by hand. Okay. Put you in there. Okay, drop you. Okay. Now do I go to town on you? <laughs> hey. Okay, maybe not. Let's get our phone back. Uh, the phone is smashed. No way it's gonna work anytime soon. I can't get further through here. There's no door hand. Why would he hit me and then lock me in here? Who knows? So we need that like grip the whatever it was. Ooh, cha cha cha. Okay, do we need that? Uh, it was in here, right? All right. Now? Hey! Oh God, stuck. Progress. Fucking tell me about it. What the hell was that? There we go. Dark as shit, yo. Hello? What is this? A wallet? Hey, wallet. That's whose blood, I guess. Okay. Hello? Yo, this got hella creepy. Okay. Get some protection. You can interact with objects in front of you. Try both. Okay. Fuck. Uh... 
not in place. Well, fuck you. There we go. There we go. Come near me, I'll cut off your balls, bitch. Don't come near me. I'm armed in a different manner. I want to check if I can put the stupid brightness up. Jesus Christ. Brightness. Ah, there we go. Okay, I gotta put it up to max just so that we can see and it gives me less editing later. Alright. Oh, Jesus. It's a little... Oh, God. It's a little better. Oh, we're in the bathroom. Okay. Why is it so fucking chuggy now? Okay, I don't think we need the, uh... Other thing. I'm gonna actually turn the brightness down a little bit. There we go. Yes. Alright, there we go. I don't know why the brightness chugs the game. That's weird. Shut up, ambient music. Your shit is not needed. Oh god! There we go. is this I can't interact with it all right I can interact with this Ooh, that was... Did someone hear that shit's creepy dude it's holding with the wires Fucking wires. Ready to cut the wire. Oh. Boop. Any more wires? Okay. Taking these with me. Hello? I warned you before, I'll cut your balls off. Don't touch me. <gasps> oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Fucking warned you, I'm armed. I fucking warned you, I ar I'm armed. Don't fuck with me, bitch. Don't fuck with me. <sighs> fuck. Okay, I think we gotta go downstairs. What's this? The fuse box opener is locked in the old house in my duffel bag. Okay. Weird for him to leave a note. Alright. I'm actually going to leave this episode here. You guys, this is a game that's really... This one and what I have planned for Halloween is going to really show you how bad I am with horror. But I'm doing it for you guys. So, I'm actually going to leave this episode here. We've got our feet set in. Dipped in the water. We've got our roots planted. However you want to say it. We've got started, and we'll continue on in the next episode. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, check out my cards, see some other stuff I've done for you guys, and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. With that being said, guys, hope to catch you guys in the next video. Bye bye